Look at this garbage, so I'm going to grab it. Okay, then the garbage. It's not too good. First one. I'm thinking it's tasty like medicine. Plenty vitamins in it, pregnant women eat it. Leave it. Do Africans even know vitamins? Is that is that your word? Yeah. Africanizing ourselves. For many years now, we've been used to selling foods that we have Africanized, which are more British, which are more English. But this is an introduction to pure European food. So the shop is understandable. Yeah. 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 My rice, eh? That rice. Eat that rice because I'm going to eat that rice. Do you this one meat? <laughs> I, I asked her to make um, the delicious ones the last. The last. Can you imagine <laughs> this one? <laughs> Gala Kuchaka. Gala Kuchaka. Gala Kuchaka. Gala Kuchaka. Gala Kuchaka. Kuchaka. No, I'm not beginning to understand that Europeans also have some quite Africanist kind of names like Kutakite, Kushaka, like Shaka. I have the name Kushaka. Everybody's going to understand I'm African. Galar Kuchaka. Yes. Galar Kuchaka. Galar Kuchaka. This one, you first have fun, you like taste. Then the chicken gives it. This is the blend of the taste, it makes it nice. Mm. But when you first get it, the vinegar too mm -hmm. adds taste to it because it gives you a sour taste to your mouth. Mm -hmm. So is it nice? Oh, it's okay. This is the nicest so far. So would you pay for it in a restaurant? Let me give you from a Ghanaian perspective. Ask the girl, if I take it to a restaurant, what food would you order? And she was like, Jalof is my food. And I was like, ah, Jalof is my food. Then she was like, ah, you want to follow me to a classic restaurant to eat Jalof? I want to give you gourmet. Of course, I will order food like this. It's so beautiful. I surely get a Ghanaian girl with this as a, a guy going out with a girl. It's beautiful food. I mean, I'm trying to advise Polish men that they should get Ghanaian girls to Galat. No, that's not that. Please tell me to just watch it. Have you been to a restaurant that you check the menu and you see something you don't know? Then, because of the day, you just cook it. Then you find out that you can't eat it. And it was. It's like Jenny, right? I wouldn't order this one. Okay. I wouldn't order this one. But I have this. I'm, I have this. I'm adverse towards Jenny. Aha, uh thanks. -huh, it tastes uh, funny in a lot. But the chicken is nice. I like the jelly. Like the jelly. <laughs> yes, you would like the jelly. Can you get some other food? You know what this one? <laughs> <laughs> like nuts. Nuts, you know, nuts, other things, you know. Like appetizers, right? What do you want to say? How do you spend the pen taste? I'm not sure what I was going to do. Tastes like appetizers. Like what? Apartheid. Apartheid is our local, the local food. The gin. Just like the gin. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like sweet and sour. Yes. Sweet and sour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the cold one. You have to freeze it. You have to put it in the fridge. Yes, it's from the fridge. Yes, so easy to handle. Easy to handle. Because most people cannot handle sour. We don't like it. You have to. You have to be used. Barsif croquette, barsif. Barsh. Barsh. Barsish. Barsh croquette. Barsish. Barsh. Bar. Barsh. Barsh. Croquette. Beetroot. So how do you use How do you call this soup? That's the soup for us. That's sugar. Yeah. But it's a bit to see. Very well. We like it. This is absolutely no problem. 
was named. <laughs> they came. He just came. <laughs> <laughs> are we are we having a pussy? No, 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 no. The taste different. It's yeah. not like the usual uh, mashed potatoes. How do you like it? Yeah, it's very nice. I like this. This is a main meal. This yeah. is a lunch. This is a lunch. <laughs> Don't look after me. I will love you that much. It's nice with the milk. It's nice with the milk. Try it again. Mmm. 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 Now let's get the chocolate. Yes, ma'am. I wonder if it's fresh. Do you like it? Yeah. Like the sauce, you see how the potato is sweet. Then when you now put it in there, it doesn't give it just too much sweetness. It just gives it a blend. It's perfect. What do you call perfect? You call it perfect. Perfect thing. Perfect thing. That is a very popular. It's Polish food and very Polish at the same time. Yes. It's good. It's good. I love it. I think there is one. Pierogi, Miesa. Pierogi, Miesa. 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 Yeah. What is inside that? Pierogi. 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 Pier do you want this in the restaurant? Yes. Oh, yes. Sir. Sir. Good. How do they say perfect in Polish? Perfect sinner. Perfect sinner. Are you sure it's perfect sinner? <laughs> <laughs> because I'm a black man. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just eat it. <laughs> it's so beautiful. You like it a lot? Yeah, it's very nice. What about you? It's gone. I'm going to do Rushki. Rushki. Pierogi. Rushki. Pierogi. Rushki. Pierogi. Rushki. This thing is different. Now, when an African is eating and the meat is gone, it's good. Appetite don't lose. Are you sure? Yes. This is just I know. I love it. I love this one better than the pierogi. It's me and some. Yeah. I love this one more. You like this one? The first one. I love this one more than the. Do you know how to say white cheese in my language? Say it Faruk. 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 Yeah, very nice. What about you? Faruk. 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 Like Faruk. This has been an experience, um, pleasant, most most parts, very pleasant. Um, it's, the taste is uh, kind of strange to me, but it's something I'd like to try again. Okay. Yeah, honestly. So you guys are going to Poland for a tourist trip? Yeah. Um, I loved it. Yes. She loved it. She's uh, my partner here. <laughs> <laughs> well, commentator. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I will give him the honor to make the final to give the final remarks. To say I want to pull her for food. I'm not sure. You're not sure. Mm -hmm. Why? If it's only food, no. Okay. I would want to go to pull for something else. Um, something more. What kind? No, I mean. <laughs> But for anything else, fine. Tourism, meet the people, yeah. talk to them. We have plenty of castles. Industry. Come again. We have plenty of castles. Castles? Yes, I love history, I love archaeology. So I will go there, find out about the history of uh, that part of Europe. Mm -hmm. And then the food, along the way, the food too. Really. We'll call. So would you go to Poland on the food purposes? Mm -hmm. What are the food? 
I would like to try the food that he had and then see the kind of people who are, okay. you know. Uh, but I would go with my pepe. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the last final few words of, for Polish people about the like in the food places. Uh, Polish Polish people should try eba. They should try eba <laughs> more than to faint. They, <laughs> they, they should try something with Africa. It's a beautiful experience in Africa, outside Africa. So it's beautiful. Polish people, I love you. Thank you for loving that. Jacqueline, 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 Jacqueline.